Boredom. That's what describes Sony's E3 conference. Well, you know, granted they had the content. They definitely had the content. But their presentation was just terrible. It's like taking a class that you really enjoy in college, but your professor is boring as can be. You know, they talked a lot about the PlayStation Vita. You know, it means life. Vita means life. I don't know what language that's from, but it looks like a really good portable console. And, uh, yeah, they showed us some games. Games we already knew. Games that were already rumored. It was just boring. Absolutely boring. Now, I didn't miss a lot of it, but now I'm glad I did because it just wasn't that exciting. Period. You know, in the very beginning, they had an amazing opening. Awesome song, great montage of games, all that, but I guess that was the only good part that was actually exciting, invigorating, enriching to see. Right after I left, they talked about some media stuff, MLB, Hulu, Music Unlimited, I don't care about those. Uh, Uncharted 3, we knew that was coming. And uh, they showed Resistance 3. Did they show, like, gameplay of it? Yeah. Yeah? Was it good? No. It was just one short, one short level. And just, this next level was just a guy walking around carrying this box of junk. <laughs> See, I really love Resistance. And if they screw it up, I'm going to be really, really pissed. Uh, remastered version of God of War, PSP games, yeah, you know, those are good games, all that, yeah. We know Eco, Shadow uh, Colossus, Bone Coming. PlayStation TV, 3D goggles, glasses, I don't care. NBA Move with Kobe, really don't care. Some lame <laughs> game that looks like a kitty fable game. What was that called? I still forgot. Yeah. It was, like, it, had to, it was like something for the move, like this guy was pretending he had a sword, so he would be like this, pretending he like... Oh, it was a move out. game? Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Uh, Infamous 2, I want that. I knew that was coming. Living Planet 2 getting addition to make move, levels with move, okay. Yeah, we knew that was coming. Starhawk? Okay, yeah, we knew that was already coming. Sly 4, we knew that was rumored. Dust, that's something new. A cross-platform uh, MMO game. And from what I heard, it looks like Fable. Not Fable, uh, Halo. Yeah? Uh, might be good. Uh, Bioshock Infinite, it has Bioshock on the same disc. So you're getting a free game. Because you have the room on the uh, Blu-ray. There's something about that. You know, just like last year, we got a free Medal of Honor game. We got other free content because we have the room for it. Uh, let's see. Uh, Saints Row. Saints Third. Exclusive content. Need for Speed. Exclusive content. Battlefield 3. Exclusive content. Real exclusive content that you won't ever see on 360. But they're bragging about freaking... Map packs. That's how you know when people lose sight of what's most important in gaming. When they're bragging about map packs coming first. <laughs> Fifty dollar map packs with map packs from old Call of Duty games. We get it first. <laughs> Oh. oh, fantastic. Absolutely fantastic. I love seeing how weak people's minds are. Uh, a Star Trek game. Yeah, whoop they do Need for Speed exclusive content. I already said that. Uh, PlayStation Suite, don't care. Now, the thing with PlayStation Vita is that AT&T. You couldn't call Verizon? Seriously? You partnered with AT&T? That's one step away from Sprint. Okay? 
That's bad. You hear the booze when he said AT and T? They messed up on that. And then we got some, you know, Vita games. And at this point, I just stopped, you know, doing my outline. I just didn't care anymore. I know that I knew the NGP was coming. I knew the NGP would get a bunch of great games. I didn't really get anything new except for uh, dust, and uh, that's it. Now, Sony did do one thing Microsoft didn't do. Sony showed games for gamers, and uh, I, they have a great portable content, uh, portable console coming out, and you know it was just boring. It, nothing got me excited. Even though I missed, you know, a great majority of it when I came back, you know, old news, boring, 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 boring. That's all I got to say about the Sunday conference. Uh, you know, I'd give it a freaking D. You know, good content, but presentation was terrible. It's like, you know, you gave me what I wanted in the essay, but all the spelling errors and grammar problems is just inexcusable. Sony could have done better than that. That boring garbage. It's like you had business. <laughs> you all have a good day. I'll see you all tomorrow for the Nintendo conference. Well, I know! I'll get some entertainment, some games, and a load of good content. Project Cafe. Oh, man. It needs to come. I'm waiting for it.